Think about it. When was the last time you used an algebraic equation? Now, how about when was the last time you fixed dinner? in our rush to become as academically competitive as we can, an unintended consequence has developed. Fewer and fewer young adults now know how to do the simple things, like how to cook or how to bounce a checkbook or even how to sew on a button. Basic life skills that are as important today as they ever were. Here's our Courtney Dehoff. With households watching every penny, a growing number of Americans are ditching their takeout menus and heading into the kitchen to cook dinner at home. The trouble is, many don't know how. We caught up with an Oklahoma teacher who's teaching some old life skills to a new generation. Well, you kind of got some tight stitches. But she I'm may be ripping out stitches, but this yeah. extraordinary so teacher is stitching, stitching lifelong in lessons yeah. into her students. Right. Okay. My heart is in the classroom. I teach with my heart and I teach with my mind. Okay, well look oh, at A type of teaching that landed Fran Stellman, a Stillwater High School family and consumer science teacher, among the top educators in the state. Each school nominates the teacher and then uh, the, um, the, from that the district picks three finalists uh, and then those three finalists have to complete a portfolio and go through the interviewing process and then you are selected from the pool of three. Stellman soon found out she was one of the top 12 statewide finalists. And while she didn't win, Stillman will always be a winner in the eyes of the judges that really matter, her students. She's like the best teacher I've ever had. She's amazing. She knows how to work with kids and everything. It's awesome. I love this class. It's my favorite class by far. A class that is less about school and more about life. Family and Consumer Sciences is the only uh, high school class that truly focuses on the family as well as careers. Um, when students walk into my classroom, they quickly find that uh, the course offerings are rich in diversity and that all learning is engaging and relevant and challenging. I can incorporate learning activities where students can take uh, the knowledge and skills that I have taught them and apply it on a hands-on situation, which is awesome. Life situations that are often overlooked in today's technologically advanced society yet as relevant as the clothes we wear and the food we eat. You saw them in here sewing. They, there's more to sewing than just pinning and sewing. They have to measure. They have to be precise in cutting. Uh, sewing also t teaches a student to be patient. Um, you saw peer tutoring going on. And through the sewing project, they develop interpersonal skills. And also for a lot of the classes, all the classes that I teach, because I use hands-on activities, group, group settings, as well as individual work, but they are able to develop their inner, um, interpersonal skills, uh, strengthen their peer relationships by helping or working with one another. Uh, they have to be responsible uh, in my food labs as well as in my sewing lab. I have uh, rotation charts where students have different jobs every day and as a team they all have to work together in order to be successful. With all of these life skills, students are taking much more than a pair of pants or a recipe out the door when they leave, but lifelong lessons. Learning such basic skills makes economic sense. Depending on what you cook, making your own meals can save up to 75% over eating out at restaurants.